From hospital space to essential businesses, our team is covering multiple local angles of this coronavirus outbreak. Let's get started with Cairo 7's D.D. Sun live in Seattle. Yeah, D.D., people around King County, they are getting the first rounds of at-home COVID-19 test kits. And you just talked to someone who did his test and put it in the mail? That's right, and those test kits are now coming back here to the Seattle Flu Study Labs, which is at the UW uh, Medical Center right here behind me. And now the 51-year-old man I talked with, he tells me he had a cough and his symptoms felt like a minor cold. The interesting part about this whole thing is that hundreds of test kits are getting mailed out every day, and some of those are going to people who are still healthy. This involves um, uh, you signing up online and us mailing you a kit that allows you to swab yourself. This doctor is talking about these home COVID-19 test kits people are getting in the mail right now. He's with the new Seattle Coronavirus Assessment Network, known as SCAN, which launched this week. There is a package sitting right my door. Todd Stevenson, whom I spoke with on the phone, is among the first people to get the home kit. He shared these photos with me. It includes a biohazard bag, a test vial with solution to preserve the virus, one swab, and a box that can hold up the tube. This video provided by the SCAN team shows you what to do. Put it in my nostril about an inch or so, spun it around a few times, and then put the swab in the vial. The new scan organization is made up by the team behind the Seattle flu study and Seattle King County Public Health, plus other researchers. Public Health emphasizes the purpose is a surveillance program and not a clinical service. It's mailing out about 300 tests a day right now to a cross section of neighborhoods to people who are both sick and healthy. The package is prepaid for you to ship it back. Understanding those dynamics of how the virus is moving is really important for then informing what kinds of social distancing measures are going to be most effective. Here's how you can sign up. The website is scanpublichealth.org. You fill out a survey including your zip code and any symptoms. Todd Stevenson says he got his kit delivered the same day. The project is funded by Gates Ventures, the private office of Bill Gates, and also gets technical help from the Gates Foundation, the CDC, and Amazon Care. Well, I think it's fantastic. I really, really hope that they can do something like this more nationwide. As you might expect, there is a huge demand for these tests, and so they run out of them every day. They were gone by the time I checked around 11 o'clock this morning. Public Health says this is for research, and so they can see whether or not people who are not showing any symptoms are, in fact, infected. They also say that these tests are repurposed flu tests and do not take away any resources from hospitals. Live in Seattle, D.D. Sun, Cairo 7 News.